Jonas Encore allows you to schedule unattended updates to the system at a time that is most convenient for your club. This video will help get you acquainted with the software update notification and scheduling process. If you are Encore hosted, Encore updates will be pre-scheduled and run for you. You will still have to run through some prompts the first time you open Encore after the update and upgrade Encore on your workstation. If you are not Encore hosted, before reviewing the update process, let's take a look at how to select which users are notified that an update is available. To select these users, navigate to System Administration, System Setups, and Users. Select the user, and in the General Core Information tab, enable Provide Update Notifications. Then click Save to save your changes and complete this process for any other users that should be notified when an update is available. When an update is available for your Jonas Encore system, the system will deliver a pop-up notification message to the users that have been flagged to receive update notifications. This message will display in the bottom right-hand corner of the system when logged into Encore. The Jonas notification will indicate the version of the update with a link to the update scheduler. This message will stay on screen until closed. Once the upgrade has been scheduled, this message will not appear for any users moving forward. Once you see the update notification, go ahead and click here to schedule. Doing so will launch the Encore Automatic Update Scheduler. Use this screen to set the date and time you would like to have your Jonas Encore system updated. It is important to note that updating Jonas Encore requires all users to be logged off the system. The Automatic Update Scheduler allows your club to schedule an unattended update at a time when all users will be logged off of Encore, for example, overnight, with no impact to club operations. Note that the Automatic Update Scheduler allows you to schedule updates between the hours of 11 p.m. Sunday to 5 a.m. Thursday local time. If you wish to update your system outside of this range, please contact Jonas Encore Support. After setting the date and time, click the Save Schedule button. Depending on the time you selected, you may receive a pop-up letting you know you've scheduled the update during business hours. If you would still like to schedule the update for this time, click Yes to proceed. You will receive a prompt letting you know that the Encore update has been scheduled successfully. Click OK to confirm this message. If you wish to change the scheduled date or time of the Encore update for any reason, you can do so by navigating to System Administration, System Setups, and Global Settings. Then click the Program Update Settings button. From here, click the Schedule RUA Update button, where you can adjust the date and time accordingly. Then click the Update Schedule button you will receive a pop-up letting you know an update has already been scheduled. If you want to update that current schedule, click Yes. And you will receive a pop-up informing you that the schedule has been updated, where you can go ahead and click OK to acknowledge the message. Don't forget to hit Save and Save. If the upgrade has been scheduled while users are still in the system, when the scheduled date and time draw near, the system will notify all Encore users who are logged in within five minutes of the scheduled update time that the update will be taking place shortly and they must log out of Encore. Once the system is ready to update, any user still logged in will be forced out of the system. During the update, the Jonas Encore system may be unavailable for about 15 to 30 minutes, depending on the speed of the update. Once the update has completed, Users can log back into Encore where they will be prompted to update their own terminals. If you have any questions regarding the update notifications or scheduling an automated update, please contact Jonas Encore support by phone or email. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more how-to videos and don't forget to subscribe.